WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. It's uh, 2 p.m. I'm Steve Rhodes, and uh, right now we've got the Dow trading down 23 points. She's printing 27,336. S&P is down 11 points, about four-tenths of a percent to the downside. NDX 100 off 48. Brussels 2000 is in the green. Uh, the other indices to the downside, with the exception of the transports, that's trading up 206 points, nearly 2% to the upside uh, out there. Spot volatility index trading down to 1302, well below its 50-day exponential moving average. It's up 34 pennies. The numbers on I'm going to give you. I'm going to pull over this chart right here. It's actually not a chart as much as it is a, a data set. Uh, what this shows you, uh, there's several columns out here. The one to really focus on is the one that says daily OUL support out there. That is Stevie's green or red line level. Those are the numbers that you're watching to see if price closes below. If price doesn't close below that, it's no signal. It's a, it, it doesn't confirm any type of change in trend out there. If you take a look at the ES Mini, if you're trading the ES Mini, watch 3006. These numbers are going to change slightly, but you'll have a fairly good ballpark coming into today's close. And the NQ, it's 79.39. And the Dow, it's 27.329 out there. If we take, uh, uh, I apologize. Let me give you those numbers again. 3,005 in the ES Mini, 79.17 inside the NQ, 27,130 inside the YM. In the cash indices for the S&P 500 is 3,002. For the Dow, it's 27,139. For the next NDX 100, it's 78,97. Uh, for the semis, it's uh, 1,480. Uh, for the NASDAQ composite, it's 8191. Those are the numbers you want to be paying attention to. The reason is, is because of the pattern formations that are in place right now. For example, let me pull over here the, um, well, let me do this. Let me pull over the Dow Equity Futures contract. What's the Dow Equity Futures contract doing? Well, you've got a small A to B equals CD pattern out here. But not until you get a bearish reversal candle and a close below Stevie's green line, that's 27,131. Are you going to have a confirmation of some type of top out there? If we go take a look at the cash indices out here, and the cash indices, it's in the S&P 500. It's got a nice topping pattern out there, a potential topping pattern. And that here is Stevie's Rhodes Momentum Indicator Signal. Watch those numbers coming into today's close. They'll tell you whether support has been broken. Stay tuned for a great hour. David White, the polar bear. He's up next. Have a great Tuesday, folks.